Okay. All right, well, let's start. Okay. Uh, last time we did like a sun solar line like this. Okay, today I find out if we want to be able to finish in an hour, we need to do different uh, strategy. Okay. So what we can do is we can see all the uh, picture with the uh, straight line. Okay, you can see that. You can see last time we tried to do every single one to connect this, the vanishing point it was somewhere here, right? But in able to show you every single one like this, it'll take a while, okay, it'll take a while. So what strategy we have today is we're going to do the, all the straight line, okay, based on, you see all the straight line, you first, you kind of guide where it is, you place them. So that's why I do here, every single one here. So I do really line line. I do every single one like here, okay? Every single one. So you can see this line here, so I place it right here. This line here, place here okay then yeah you try to get all the straight line really light based on this the center line the center the venture point here you see all this one on the, the left on the right then you just building up okay the line has to be light so we're going to use the ruler to end up to continue this line you now straighten up then every single thing like this here, they will go to converging to the ranging point. We are going to use uh, the ruler to connect the ranging point, to connect that. Okay, so now we're going to do, so we're going to find out all the straight line. You see every single one, a straight line, based on the ranging point here, we're going to build. This is some of the lines, really fine one, like a here. <laughs> Really close. I don't know you can make it, but try, try to do that. Uh, some of the line, may, maybe we cannot get it. Okay, some of the line is really fine, like here. The fence, okay, like uh, the, the window is uh, some little short, like a little fence like that. That's really hard for do that, but we, we can do as much as we can because the paper is really tiny, okay? Then some of the windows, the space is really close. But we just indicate a uh, uh, horizontal line, and uh, I mean the vertical line, okay? So to vertical for that, whatever need to be converging, we will come back to do that, okay? Anyone know what I'm saying? Okay, so we're going to do to find out every single vertical line. And the way is based on the, the vention point. Okay, hi, Angel. Can you hear me? And uh, can you hear me? You, turn, you didn't turn on your speaker. And, uh, and uh, can you hear me? Yes, no? Okay. We have done so much last week, but kind of slow. So find out <clears throat> it, it's hard for me to show every single one and do one at a time, okay? Then we did this part of them. We did this building here. Then we also show this building, this side here. And between them, they have a space, like uh, uh, the alley so they can go through. But today, instead I show you every single one like this, I go, I'm going to ask you to do is Based on the vision point, which is the, the little lady figures here, the center of the head, the circle here, that's the vision point here. From here, you can see all the vertical line. Use a pencil to guide you, do a little, little sketch out, okay? Then later on, we're going to, is every single one, every single one you see here, okay? You draw the line like I do here, you see that? kind of guide yourself, okay? Then after we've done that, after we've done all the vertical line, we're going to use a ruler to straighten up. And if we have to go into a vention point, 
we are going back to use a ruler to create the converging line. Okay, everyone can do it. Okay, wow. So Adam redo the, the street here. <laughs> you are playing ahead again. All right, okay, so let's do it, okay? Draw all the line you can see. Then after that, you down every single vertical line. You straighten them up, okay, with the ruler. Then we do some the horizontal line. When we, once we done those, we do horizontal line. Then after that, we do the uh, converging line with the ruler, okay? If you got trouble, uh, let me know, okay? Otherwise, I think one hour, I would take a while to finish this, okay? There's quite a lot of detail thing, okay? You can see some of the things this artist did. She did quite a lot with the ruler, okay? A lot of part. But some of the part is a free hand. How do I know? Because those French door, it's kind of free hand line, okay? You can see uh, some of the shadow cast, the line's not really straight. It's like a use free hand, okay? But some of the shadow here is pretty much is a, with the ruler. Okay, so let's do it. So go to find all the vertical lines. I will do first, I create almost like a square right here. Okay, here's almost a square, right? So based on this square, I find out where the, the thing go. Okay, I draw a vertical line here. So this vertical line, I draw a line here. So I know so, uh, I got the left, okay, on my right, left hand side away from the center line. So just start building up all the line I see. Okay, all right, let's do it. Let me see. Okay. Okay, this artist did a lot of free hand, but some is very, it's pretty much just a ruler, okay? so. So you kind of with uh, eyeballing to see where is the thing. Okay, so here and here. Okay, so here's the thing over the top. Okay, now just keep uh, as uh, straight you can. Kind of give yourself like an idea. The spacing is, you know, there's a leeway, so it won't be exactly the same as uh, the picture we see. Not close enough. Okay. Most important is the last step. The last step we're going to use converging line. So whenever we create a vertical line, we have to go to converging, especially the window or door. Okay. So based on all the observation, the building on the, the end here, I think it's about five story, okay? About five story high, or four story high. But you can see the V top on top, the, the attic, 
this is uh, another construction. So that if you count that one, I think that's the fifth floor. Okay. So pretty much finished uh, the ones uh, on the, the end of the building, the, the street, there's a, a building right there that create some basic structure like that. Okay. We, if we saw this way to do it, then it's really tough. Because every single one stay and do it, trust me, it take a while, okay? It will really take a while to finish it. The only way you have to do is eyeballing and put as much as you can. Hi, Ava. Hello, Ava. Can you hear me? Hi, yeah. Are you still in the car? Yeah, I'm still in the car. I'll be home in uh, 30 minutes, I think. Okay, so what we're we going to do today is, if you see it, we we are we are not going to show you every single one. Instead, we uh have to like do the sketches based on the ranging point. Last time we create, I create almost like a square here. So this is the character's head. The middle of the head will be the ranging point. So we going to do is we see the picture we have, which is this one. Okay, now we were going to based on this suspension point here, we draw all the vertical line. Okay, all the vertical line, then all the horizontal line, we're going to do that. Okay, we can find out where it is. Then we cannot, I cannot tell you how many percent of the line here. But we eyeball it, we do that. Okay, we freehand to do those first. Then after we've done the all the vertical line, we do a horizontal line. So first thing I do is I finish this, the end of the street, this part of beauty, okay? So I create like this, okay? Then we pretty much freehand. After that, we've done all the sketches out on the paper, we're going to use a ruler to kind of continue them. Vertical line will straighten up, horizontal line, even the, the, this drawing, you can see it's a free hand, okay? So if you have free hand, it's nice and nice. Uh, it lives like that, okay? But after we've done all the vertical line, horizontal line, we're going to find out where the, those objects going to converge into the venture point. Then we're going to use the ruler to connect to that, okay? All those things, the rain gutter, the, those, uh, the pipe, all things. We probably end up we're going to use the ruler to straighten them up. Okay, that's why we do. All right. So you can see how we do. So I can show you that. But most of people are doing that now. Okay. Uh Jake, so what can I okay, Jake, like I said, you can you can for now sketchy. 
Okay, you just sketch out on your paper. Okay. Okay, we're going to freehand to locate where the object is. Once we're done, yeah, we're going to use the ruler to straighten them out. Okay. Make sure make sure the straight line has to be 90 degrees to the horizon line. Okay, you cannot go like this, this. Whole thing will be looks really odd. Okay. So once you've done that, uh, how you do that? Uh, okay. You can keep this one here. Then put a ruler like this. You can draw the line, make sure the line will be perfect straight. Okay, it will be like this. So this line will be perfect straight. Okay, every single line you see here. It will be that way. Okay, or you can put under under the the paper right somewhere here. Make sure parallel to the horizon line. Then all the line vertical will be perfect parallel to each other. Okay, but now still we work on the basic shape thing. All right, Cecilia, are you okay? Cecilia. Yeah, I'm good. You know what I'm doing, right? You see how yes. I do it, right? Kind of free hand out. Yeah. Because if I do every single one demo ask you to do follow me, it will take forever. We probably like a three three classes just doing this thing. <laughs> but you can okay. see a lot of the, uh, the thing on the 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 ref photo reference I gave to you. This is free hand. Okay. But just some of the line, just be careful, some of the line, vertical line. And the horizontal line, uh, we might use the ruler and the converging line. Okay, quite a lot of things actually is a free hand. Okay, all right. Got it. Okay. Good. Okay, we we'll keep going then.
I don't know you can find uh, something uh, kind of weird for a structure. I think this side, this part, uh, the feature of the uh, the construction structure here, this thing kind of unique for the building. It has like a little bit here curving, and you can see the, the fence like this, okay? And a little piece of the structure here on top of this. Okay, this part. I think you part was a bit confused with this. Okay. I, for me, this uh, building kind of, uh, she part missing that this part here. When she draw this one for anime, okay. She part missing that, she just only showed that this part building. Okay, and uh, this, this one, the structure of the building here is pretty much uh, on the line of the benching point we close. So how you can show it's supposed to go out a little bit, but he didn't, okay. So we can tell this, this, this guy's uh, drawing this picture, he didn't really go to a benching point for this side, okay. Otherwise, this one's supposed to go into venting point. It'll be like this, going out. You can supposed to be a little bit this side, the facade of the building here, a little bit. But she didn't. You can see that the, uh, the, the top, the ceiling, go curved in. So you create another venting point over here. Okay? So if you, if you follow this guy drawing, this guy drawing has some problem. <laughs> He didn't go to vision point right here. This one's how we go to here. Okay. So we follow the uh, the photo reference. But just let you know the photo reference has some problem. Okay. Not everything goes to vision point, the same vision point. Okay.
And then I don't know, you guys see a big trash can right here. Right somewhere here. Okay, and are you doing okay? Yeah, uh, like I said, you can feel free hand. Then if you need, you can use the ruler to help. Okay, but watch out, watch out the, uh, the straight line and the vertical line. Okay, remember all the line go to vanishing point, have to use the ruler to make sure they go to vanishing point. See all these lines, to vanishing point. Okay, we go to vision point. Okay, however, we find out the original photo reference. This artist didn't do that. Okay, so some of the lines go wrong. Like I say, show the balcony here, the ceiling of balcony. They suppose go to here, but they go inside. So, uh, okay, but we do whatever we supposed to do with that. But we just understand. This photo reference, this artist didn't follow some of the, this rule. <laughs> so you can see that, that, whoa, what happened to this line here? Well, because it didn't follow the rule. Okay, so let you know.
Okay, we found this this one has a little bit the tire roof over this side here. Okay. Okay, and uh, look like you are uh, stuck. And uh, you know how to do? See, so far I have done this much. Okay, you have to see how far away from the finish point to find out those lines where is it. Okay, I know you probably say, ah, oh, I cannot get it exactly where it is. It's fine, just just approximately. You won't get exactly where it is, okay? You won't, because we can meet you out every single one by this little bit, how much, how much. Then we just eyeball it, okay? We use this one. Basically, we want to use this as the photo reference. We create similar like that, okay? We won't be able to do exactly the same what we see, but close enough. We use this one to practice for one point perspective. Okay, a lot of things like uh, the balcony here, the building here, pretty much a free hand. Okay, you draw this all by free hand. Okay, because it takes forever if we keep doing every single one as a ruler, it's impossible. Okay, take forever. So we just do free hand. Okay, but you, you got to have a, like a Steady hand though, okay? Gotta have a steady hand. So make sure this line nice and smooth. But if you cannot, yeah, feel free to use the, uh, the ruler to help you, okay? That, but I say, uh, when you do that, make sure the line is parallel to horizon line, for horizon line, or horizontal line. Vertical line, make sure they're vertical 90 degree to the Horizon line. Okay, if you keep that way, it'll be okay. Now all the things go to vanishing point, make sure they go to vanishing point. You have to line up to vanishing point. Okay. If you follow that 
kind of rule, you'll be fine. Okay. Some of the part is really hard to draw a uh, little tiny space. For example, this is two window, the two window here. One is like a here, almost like a little tiny space. And this, this another one's right here. And the bottom of the window will be like somewhere here. Okay, will be like a little tiny space. Almost impossible to, to draw that. Okay, this two window, you can see. So little tiny. Uh, we just do whatever we can, okay? I see here has something can come out of the balcony here. This is for the tire house. Something that come out to here. Okay, this one make sure they go to vention point as well. Go to vention point. First line, vertical line, let's see. 90 degree to that. Okay. I, I don't know you guys know what's this. Do you know what's this? You guys know what's this thing here? Will be on the paper. Do you guys know what's that? This part. <laughs> air conditioner? Look like air conditioner, yeah. <clears throat> you know, in uh, Asia has a lot of those things, portable, uh, they continue in the outdoor. So they put the, like a, against, uh, attached to a window, so they suck it up. Yeah, pretty good. So uh, Adam, you see this stuff before, right? Yeah. So, yeah, in Asia it has a lot, but here most of the building, so most of the house, if you live in the city, you go out here, you might not get it. But if you're able to go to Asia or some of the city, they just uh, have to put uh, those kind of portable uh, AC outside attached to the building. Okay, so yeah, just like uh, Adam said, this is like a, the AC. In Japan, has a lot. In Japan, has a lot. Yeah. It's called Hitachi or something. I forgot the brand. Okay. Yeah, just to let you know. Some style you draw is saying, what the heck is that? I have no clue. Well, because we don't see that here, okay? So I can see some of the plane has a van climbing here, right here. Okay, and then here, stairway like this. Okay, so on this side, I pretty much done. I just need to draw a little bit same detail here. And okay, there's a window. Okay. <clears throat> this one pretty much freehand too. You might have finished the left side. <clears throat> well, you can you can add some detail right, if you want to. So I don't know uh, <clears throat> in China or something like that, Asia, but in Taiwan, okay, we did a house, especially like the outside connect connect to the outside the window. We will put a fence outside the window, okay? You can see a lot, okay? Just to, just to preventing to get like a, a rubber, 
Okay, so outside the window, I then build a, like a fence like that. Okay. Okay, so yeah. So organic looking. Okay, so if you want to do that, you can make this organic just line with a free hand, more organic looking. It's like this. Okay. So and then he did it's a ditch. Okay, city the uh drain sewage is underneath it. This usually like a a cement. They cover the 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 drain drain system. So underneath pretty much the drain system uh, here, the both sides. Okay. And this side too. Then so you go to vention point, right? Then you feel free hand to do that as well. If you want to. Then some of the cover for that is like parallel to the horizon line. Free hand, you can do that. The sun has that, some don't have that. Okay. Then I believe here will be higher. Okay, and here we can see this uh, this line here. You see the rain gutter come up from this building here. Okay, this uh, drawing has a lot of detail. Okay, so when you do this kind of drawing, first time, if, if we, we don't do this uh, in the classroom, I don't think you will ever try it yourself <laughs> because it's quite a lot of detail. Most of the time, I see that, I say, you know what? Forget it. Too much, too much work. But since we are practice together, then we'll try that together. So. So this is good experience. 
Next time you are going to do one point perspective drawing, then you know how how much detail you might put in for this one. Okay. So finished the uh, uh, left side. Now what kind of the right side now? Okay. Right side quite some. Okay, some uh, attachment on this side too. Okay, remember same thing. Find the object first. Okay, find object first, then place where, where the, the placement is. Okay, then after that, then we use a ruler to do that. Everything you have to go to vanishing point, you have to use a ruler to find out vanishing point is. Then to show that. Even you know, tiny space here. You need to do this too. This is like have a, a, I'm not quite sure this thing. This one maybe is another AC uh, case like here. But I'm not quite sure. Okay. So this has a little bit uh, go to pinch point on this angle. So I have to make sure this vertical line straight. Okay. So this is the case. that all right then we close this big one here there's some window and the some the uh the man has uh the concrete has a little bit line here okay so based on that you see probably somewhere here like i say um we are not exactly copy the same as the picture we just use as a reference so in this case maybe need to be bigger okay so this one's up somewhere, I say somewhere here. Okay, so you can see a uh, window structure over here. Also done. Okay, after, after we've done this, I will, I will um, send the finish uh, look. Oh, Adam, you did a pretty good job. Awesome. And the Jake did a pretty good job as well. Almost finished. Okay, yeah, I think uh, Jake still need to work on the left side here. All right. Jake, so your mom make a dinner for you tonight? Yeah. <laughs> okay, your mom working really hard. Get get her so bad. So you you yeah. Okay, let me uh, keep continue finish up. Then uh, we do some. Uh, you guys decide. Okay, you guys want to do the shadow. You can see the shadow. Uh, on the building both both side. Okay, you you can add that if you want to. Okay. I can show you how to do those. So now I'm just doing this part.
And uh, here, I'm not quite sure this is for electricity, so, so uh, meter here, the box. Okay, so right here. So this Y. And you can see if this artist used uh, everything used Lula, it would take a really long time. So she did a lot of things with uh, free hand. Okay. Like this panel, electrical panel here, like free hand. Okay. Then here, I'm not quite sure what's this. Probably the circuit box of the building. <clears throat> okay, that's a lot of detail. Yeah. You can see somewhere here has a door. You put right to here. Almost done. Okay. If if somehow you didn't finish, it's okay. You can you can finish it at home. Okay. So uh Ava, you home now? Ava, you home now? Uh, I thought two minutes. Uh you got home two minutes or you still have two minutes to get home? Still two minutes to get home. Oh my <laughs> Okay, now it's about time. Okay, <laughs> we still have a little thing didn't finish. Like I didn't finish like uh the two window here and the little bit uh the outside uh, the flowers uh, like uh stuff. Okay, and yeah, my time the same. I just I don't have the two windows here, and I just don't have this building. But everything else I'm done. That's yeah, it's pretty good. You're pretty much the same. Nice. 
your catch must be pretty good. I said, and Jake too. And ends a little bit slower. Okay. Uh, I will finish now. Post this to uh, the last uh, way chess account so she can show you guys what finish look like. Yeah, the same thing. I think add up pretty good. Pretty much done, just like the same as my pace. Pretty much the, to the same stage to here. Okay, once it's done, I can show you guys. So that's pretty much for today. So you can see something just freehand. But remember, vertical or horizontal for for uh for one point perspective is really important. And make sure this has to be nicely. I will draw out this uh, character once we're done. Now I send this picture to the okay so uh, next week i'll find something uh different than this one okay we'll talk more uh probably one or two more uh, sample of the one point perspective then we move on to two point okay any questions any questions no questions uh we end that now okay uh mm -hmm. i so Ava, I saved this uh, video tonight, so I'll send to uh, Elas, so she can give you that. You can look at one okay. more. Okay, thank you. All right, you're welcome. You guys have a good night. Bye, thank you. Bye, you're welcome. Bye, thank you. Bye now, bye. Bye, Adam, good job, impressive.